boys welcome so the festival reset today and as you can see we got ourselves the toyota celica the 2003 which is a completely brand new car and if we head on over to our auction house here as we can see there are currently none coming up in the auction house and that is because this is forza horizon 5's brand new rarest car at the moment i don't know when you're going to be watching this video if i'm being honest but if you're watching it today i posted it right now this is the rarest car in the game so where i haven't been able to get my hands on one and lord knows i'm not about to 80 percent this season this month well week in order to unlock it because that's frankly just too much work and i'd rather auction snipe it for much less work but what is all the point of me telling this telling you this you might say well as it currently stands right now this might be the best car to auction snipe uh to make the most profit in the coming weeks i don't know what i'm doing here i didn't want to get into this car now i can't tell you exactly what it's gonna sell for but if we check out these other celicas as a minimum price eleven thousand. other toyotas are like the same class kind of okay well this is 20 million but that's only because i had my tune on it but the minimum buyout you could set this to again 11,000 uh say we tried the Toyota GT86 again 16,000 so it's a pretty safe bet that the minimum buyout on these cars is gonna be in the five figure range at the very most six figures and probably as of right now they're not selling over a million again I haven't been able to get my hands on one of these yet because they're still very rare I was actually gonna release this video on the Thursday that it launched but I figured no one would have a chance to even get their hands on it yet so I actually am saying this to release on the Friday and pretty much what I'm doing today is setting out to provide you guys the best cars to auction snipe there's actually a few of them I want to cover but this is the first one try and get your hands on as many as possible over the next week I don't know how rare this is going to end up being but I know the price is definitely going to go into the millions and the other cool thing about this car is if you are able to get your hands on it if we go to designs and paint and we check out the 2003 Celica as you can see there are downloads for this cars and tunes and paint jobs uploaded but there really aren't that many yet so I mentioned in oh this one's actually kind of cool now I really want the car but I mentioned in a video probably my most recent one on how you should focus on getting legendary tuner and frankly the best way of doing that is looking through the cars that are going to be releasing the brand new ones like the Toyota there and any new car that is going to release you want to be one of the first people to unlock it you do you do have to grind if you want to do it legit and you want to legit hit legendary tuner and put your tune out for that first spam upload tunes make sure you get on that front page so that people are always downloading your tune once they finally get the car but anyways what are the other cars that I recommend you auction snipe for this week oh also if you don't have a lot of money to even start auction sniping in this game I'm gonna be covering that later in the video but I know lots of people have already seen it so I figured I'd get the important new information down at the beginning of the video for you guys that have seen it before and if you want to see the method stick around till the end it'll be like a couple minutes but number one the Hoonicorn V2 who in the right mind would have thought that this car's price would have ended up rising to 20 million for a very long time it was sitting at 15 million six hundred thousand uh but it finally took the leap and is now a 20 million dollar car and there are tons of them up so if you want to get one of these for yourself or you want to know what to auction snipe for i've actually gone ahead and bought one so i can show you the minimum bio you can set your bio price to as low as 275,000. again i don't know how many are going to come up at this price if you ask me i'd probably recommend like three to five million at the most or minimum just in that range but you can go as low as 275,000. maybe you'll get lucky who knows but the next car is actually an old friend of ours as you can see there's a couple up from a legend tuner uh that's put his up for 20 mil that's not the actual price as you can see there's one right here for 8.2 which i'm gonna try and buy but as you can see yeah the 8.2 mils are actually selling out pretty quick i don't know that i'd recommend spending that much money because it is pretty high but you could probably set your bio price to three four five million on this car and likely it's gonna sell or you're gonna find a few and this price is gonna go up it's been hovering at 8 million for a little while but as we all know it used to be 20 million so it has potential there and i actually have two more for you guys this one right here is an investment the price on these is still going up i can actually show you what it currently is and what its minimum is because i actually do own one so the minimum these can sell for right now is 154,000, and the most is 2.35 so these have gone up about 
one and a half million since I made my initial video on you buying these. So obviously good suggestion. This price is still gonna go up. So this could be a good investment car if you're still looking. And then another one that I didn't actually expect to get anywhere near this price at all is the Civic Mugen. This was like seven or eight million, not even a week ago. So again, you could set the bio price of this. I think it's very low. I have a couple, let's check. So as you can see, maximum 16 million. You wouldn't wanna search there. Minimum though is all the way down at 22,000. So if you want to be safe again, I'd say stick around the three to five million range. But yeah, if you search for these cars throughout this week, you're gonna make probably a few hundred million if you actually stick to it and you grind out the auction sniping. I know lots of people spend like five minutes like, oh, nothing shows up. He's lying. I'm not lying. You're just not doing it right. <laughs> Anyways, that's really it for the cars of this week. So let's get to what you need to do this money-making method I was talking about. You need the Lamborghini Sesto Elemento Forza Edition. Ooh, don't mind if I do. <laughs> hey, yo. Gonna want to throw this tune on it right here. Search up this race in the event blueprints and then launch it with the Lamborghini Sesto Elemento. You want to make sure auto steering is on and then set this to automatic. And then pretty much you're just going to be doing this race over and over again. All you have to do is hold the trigger. The auto steering is going to make sure you hit all the obstacles and stay on the correct path here. And then at the end of the race, if you want to keep doing it to get more skill points, you can just restart it. It's going to save. Don't worry. Or if you're done, you just press continue and you're going to get nine to 10 skill points every single time you do that. As long as your car's mastery looks exactly like this. Also, if you're still watching and you've seen this before, I don't need you to tell me that I've made this before. I'm well aware, but I covered your part at the end okay <laughs> or beginning i covered it at the beginning then once you've saved up as many points as you deem fit head on over to the porsche section of the car menu buy as many of the 2015 right here as you deem fit for 80,000. i don't know i'd recommend like 10 to 15 at a time then you're gonna get into one of those porsches come to car mastery fill it out exactly like this you don't need the wheel spin here it costs an extra three but if you have the extra you might as well spend it and if you open them in the festival or your house you can stack them up and that's pretty much it, boys. So if you made it all the way through to the end, let me know down below so I can give you a heart on your comment. I tried switching up the order of content to try and please some of you nitpickers out there today. Anyways, we will see you boys on the next video. I'm out a peace. <laughs> Also, holy French onion soup. I know I ended the video, but I've been searching for the Celica for like another hour. It's impossible. It's so rare. <laughs> Peace.